Hello, I'm Dr. Kaushiki Diveni and I'm head of the department at the Department of Obstetrics and Gynecology and senior consultant in the Department of Reproductive Medicine at Artemis Hospital, Gurgaon. Today, let's talk about AMH or antimalarian hormone, which is very commonly prescribed these days by IVF and reproductive medicine specialists. What is it? Antimalarian hormone is a blood test which has been developed recently and we have been able to use it for various purposes in the treatment of IVF and also it has been used in telling that how much of good quality oocytes are still remaining in the body of a lady at a particular age. AMH is a blood test which can be done at any time in your cycle. It need not be on day three of your period. Um, what actually AMH tells us? It tells us that at any particular point of time, how much is the quantity of oocytes which are remaining in the ovaries of a female. So how does it help? It helps by letting you decide that whether you need to rush for a family or you have got certain time. So it is particularly useful for those ladies who are in their uh, late 20s or early 30s and who are busy with their uh, career and they just come with the question that doctor how much time I have got before I plan a pregnancy. So depending on, on the AMH we can tell them and guide them whether they should go for the pregnancy early or whether they can wait for 3-4 years. But having said that though AMH tells us about the quantity of the oocyte remaining it doesn't tell us about the quality of the oocyte which obviously deteriorates with increasing age. The other aspect of AMH usage is when we are treating a patient with IVF. So the AMH helps us in deciding what should be the dose of the gonadotropin which needs to be used for stimulating a cycle and with the help of AMH we have been able to prevent so many deadly cases of ovarian hyperstimulation syndrome which is good for the females as well as the doctors both.